The pictures look so familiar. The spreading stain of oil, wildlife, dying, a massive effort to clean up the spill. But the photos show a spill four decades ago in Santa Barbara, California, an event that changed Americans' attitudes towards the environment forever. Today, Santa Barbara is an affluent, laid-back beach town set between the mountains and the sea, about two hours' drive from Los Angeles. But in January 1969, it was the scene of a catastrophe. Right here and everywhere else up and down the coast, it was black tar. It was thick black tar covering everything. John McKinney was 16 years old when Union Oil's Platform A blew out offshore, spewing tens of thousands of barrels of crude. He was one of thousands who volunteered to help clean up the spill and was put to work rescuing oil-soaked seabirds. It was my job to wander through the muck that was on these beaches and pull screaming birds from the tar. I pulled some birds alive but many more were dead. Public anger at the defilement of the beautiful coast energized a fledgling environmental movement. By the following year, the first Earth Day was observed by hundreds of thousands of Americans, and politicians took note of the movement's growing power. Within three years of the oil spill here on this beach, the U.S. Congress had set up the Environmental Protection Agency and passed the Clean Air and Clean Water Acts, the legal foundations of modern environmental policy. The Santa Barbara spill helped usher in a new era of environmental consciousness. The question now is, will the much larger and more devastating BP Gulf oil spill have a similar long-term impact? There are going to be new laws proposed. Uh, how much that ultimately changes the way we view things like oil I don't know whether this will galvanize us to really embrace the idea of alternative energy as the future of this country, or whether the anger will sort of pass and people will settle back into their normal modes of operation. John McKinney, whose experience in 1969 led to a career as a writer about nature, is skeptical. We haven't removed a single rig since the oil platform. Uh, platform A from Union Oil blew out. Rob Reynolds, Al Jazeera, Santa Barbara, California.